Hey guys, welcome back to Nextgen Vlogger. And uh, in this video, I will talk about the difference between constant parameter value and linear parameter change in VSDC free video editor. So, from the time you start editing in VSDC, you will constantly encounter these values: constant parameter value, linear parameter change, linear parameter change along a trajectory, parameter change along a curve. So, these four values. you will constantly experience from the time you start editing in vsdc free video editor and let me just show you where you will find these terms so i have already imported my demo video right here in the editor so let me just quickly go to video effects go to transforms and select resample and let me just quickly click on okay now if you look at the resample settings in the properties window you will see this straight flat line and this is constant parameter value by the way and if i just select on that it will change to linear parameter change and if i again select on that it will change to linear parameter change along a trajectory and finally it will change to parameter change along a curve now linear parameter change along a trajectory and parameter change along a curve they both come in the free version so we will not be dealing with those two uh but what we will be dealing in this video today is the first one which is constant parameter value and the second one which is linear parameter change mainly we will be understanding the basic difference between these two values because you will be constantly encountering these values so let's get started now as you can see i have already you know selected the resample effect on my video and uh, i have already um in one of my previous videos i have already explained what a resample effect does so i am not going to explain that uh, but the number one thing which difference which i want to uh, tell you about constant parameter value and linear parameter change is that constant parameter value has just one value to fill linear parameter change has two values to fill so if i just quickly select here and select linear parameter change as you can see now there are two values to fill and in constant parameter value you just had one value to fill so that's the most basic difference now let's understand what these values are exactly so if i have to explain to you in simple terms a constant parameter value in constant parameter value the parameter value remains constant throughout the effect so what that means is that i've already selected the resample uh, effect so let me just quickly change the value from 1 to 3 and on the screen as you can see my video gets uh, you know uh, gets divided in a 3 by 3 variation uh, because of the resample effect and uh, as i said in constant parameter value the parameter value remains constant throughout the effect so from the time the effect starts till the time the effect ends this is going to be a static um variation 3 by 3 variation throughout the effect so if i just play the video remember my resample effect is applied to the entire duration of the video and from the time i pressed the play button this effect will come into uh, effect basically <laughs> so this is the first thing constant parameter value and let's now jump to linear parameter change and if i just quickly select linear parameter change here and as i said you before now we have two values to fill so let me just quickly change this currently 3 by 3 is selected so let me just change it to 1 by 3 and so what does a linear parameter change does a linear parameter change in the linear parameter change the parameter value changes in a linear pattern from start to finish of the effect as per your chosen value so again if i now play the press the play button linear parameter what linear parameter change will do is that there will be a gradual transformation from a single 1 by 1 variation to a to a 3 by 3 variation so now if i play the video in constant parameter value from start to finish of the effect i had the 3 by 3 variation but in linear parameter change there is a gradual transformation from 1 by 1 variation to 3 by 3 variation so that's the most basic and easy way i can explain to you 
the difference between constant parameter value and linear parameter change let me just repeat the definitions for you once again in constant parameter value the parameter value remains constant throughout the effect and in linear parameter change the parameter value changes in a linear pattern from start to finish of the effect as per your chosen value so that's it if you just uh, rewind the video if you have not understood what this is but uh, i'm pretty sure you must have gotten a general idea of what these two values are in constant parameter value parameter values remain constant and in linear parameter change they there is a gradual transformation from your initial value to your final value which you have written in the settings so that's it guys please share with me your thoughts in the comment section below like the video subscribe to my youtube channel and i will again see you in the next video thanks for watching